Hey everybody, what's up? Alpha here. I'm going to do a review on a new episode of Assassination Classroom, Classroom or Ansatsu Kyoshitsu, episode 15. This episode right here, pretty pretty nice overall. Get, gets introduced a couple new characters here and there, so if anything else, let's go. Okay, at the beginning, we see to it that Cole sensei is just talking to his students, having fun, explaining to him about like him. Every tentacle, tentacle he loses his speed gets reduced a lot and which is pretty funny here and there and I just go like why do you even have to tell him that but yeah anyways as the episode progresses it looks like we go back to class A that's known to be the highest rank ranking class in the entire school and just by looking at it the way how they taught their friends and other students it seems to be like high tech high tech high tech studying or something you know like highly advanced anyways as the episode progresses we see to it that um the principal has a son to my surprise and it's the guy it's the orange and he's orange head to be honest with you and just by looking at his eyes he just looks like karma but the only di difference is karma redhead boy if i want to say it um pretty much has red hair red hair and he probably might be on par with like um or orange head that's the that is the principal's son, cause from what it was said in the episode later down the road, no one can actually like um, beat him, like match up to him. And I was thinking in my mind, maybe maybe Karma can. That's what I'm thinking. Well, his score short his score Karma's score at least proved at least to that point. I mean, a couple episodes back, though I don't even remember which one. Anyways. They're just getting ready for the exam so far. Karma's just slacking off, se slacking off since he knows his study, since he knows his motives already. And Cole Sensei is like telling him, "Hey, man, don't drop your guard. Keep studying." But Karma's like, "Don't worry about it. I'm just gonna be, I'm just gonna be top student notch anyway. So what's the point?" <laughs> I'm thinking in my mind, "Dang, dude, you are so confident, which I would like to have." And later, I believe the Big Five, which is pretty much Class A's. Top students, I believe, made a little bet with Class E or something. And I just go like, I'm not even really sure if you want to make that bet. But later on, the results of Orange Head. Well, I'm gonna call him Orange Head. I forgot his name, but he he's like Karma's twin. In other cases, he made the he made he made the results about like if you if we win, you know that kind of thing. And he actually wants to know the secrets of Class E because he doesn't understand how they gotten this and that. And he was pretty suspicious about this yellow tentacle guy. And that's Coral Sensei. He wants to know everything. Like, literally, it's a win-win or something. And I'm thinking in my mind, whatever, dude. I don't know what you're going to do, but it better work out. Because, guarantee, you should not underestimate a class just because they're lower rank than you. Eventually, they're eventually... Sometimes one student or one class could be very low. They could rise up to the very high top. So you best not to underestimate anyone. You better go hard or go home. That's for sure. So, yeah, everyone is just studying for their exams, especially Class E. It looks like Class A and the other classes don't have to worry about it since they're not Class E, etc. But as the battle begins, it just ends up with Nag Nag Nagisa or Nagisa getting ready to... Dominate the test like in a gladiator ring. I forgot to mention of uh, Koro Sensei telling them like, if you guys win, you guys should tell them you gotta give us some school pamphlets because it's gonna help out. So it's understandable. So yeah. Anyways, this episode is just about like getting ready for test, you know, getting ready to kick butt, and let's see what's going, where, where it's gonna go here. So that's about it. Um, expect my next review to come up a little bit late. So I'll see y'all till then. I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time, alright? Peace out. Bye-bye.